Hey guys, this is Versatile from VST Power now holds it on Project Phoenix Media and today's video game tutorial and it's a pretty good one. I'm gonna show you how you can use a PS3 game controller, the real Sony PS3, DualShock 3, emulate Xbox 360 game controller for the PC game Watch Dogs, which is only 64 bits. So how do you do this? So you go to the more info section, I got a link where you can go to this website, motionenjoy.com. And what we're going to do in today's tutorial is I'm going to use the USB method, but I'll also show you how you can use the Bluetooth method as well. So if you go to Downloads, and what I recommend is if you're going to use Bluetooth, download the 060001 version. That's the best compatibility. Get the 64 bits. In today's video, I'm actually going to use the USB method because I don't have a Bluetooth dongle right now with me. So USB is the easiest and most simplistic way to go. So if you want to go down that route, what I recommend is get the 071000 and download this link here. 32 and 64 bit all in one. So download that. I put it on my desktop here. So let me go to my desktop and I will rerun the setup for you just so you know what that looks like. So it's a wizard. Click on next here. Click on next. Click on next. Click on next. Do install it. Run the DS3 tool and you're good to go. Okay, what's going to happen is it's going to pop up some, you know, the website and everything. So you can exit that. That's fine. And at this point in time, what you want to do is go ahead and connect your PS3 game controller. I'm using the official one. Your luck may mm -hmm. vary if you're using a clone or a duplicate of the PS3 controller. So good luck with that. If it works, great. If not, then get a different controller. So I already plugged it in. And what I like to do is I go to Driver Manager and click on this little icon here and click on load driver. So you want to do that the very first time that you plug in your game controller. So we see that it has loaded, excellent. And then if you go to profiles here, here we see it recognize my DualShock 3, awesome. Go down here to X input default, select that. And then over here, click on options. Mm -hmm. And over here on the drop down, make sure you select Xbox 360 game controller and then click on save. If you want to test it, let's go to game controller panel. It's recognized as a controller for Xbox 360 wireless receiver. Awesome. Click on properties. Here's the analogs. X0, square, triangle, L1, L2, R1, R2, L3, R3. Everything's working. And here's my D-pads. Awesome. Click on OK. Click on OK. And that's it. And then you can go ahead and X the program. If you want to use a... Oh, real quick. And you can also do, uh, do vibration testing. I don't know if you can hear that, but that's my controller vibrating. And then um, if you want to do Bluetooth, what you want to do is make sure you have your Bluetooth uh, dongle already connected. And remember here when we loaded the, the driver for the controller, if you have Bluetooth, you want to select both boxes here. That'll show up. And then load the drivers. And then when you do the Bluetooth pair, it's going to show your Bluetooth that's compatible here. And then click on pair now. It's going to pair it. You disconnect your... PS3 game controller from USB and it's automatically paired. If you go to the Bluetooth wiki, there's a list of all compatible Bluetooth dongles that will work with Motion and Joy. And then that's pretty much it. I can go ahead and click on this X button here. I do not need the Xbox 360 emulator, so the X360 emulator, control emulator. I don't need that like I showed in my other similar game tutorials. And then all you got to do now is go ahead and literally run your Watch Dogs games and your PS3 game controller is recognized. So with that, with that said, excuse me, let's jump straight into the gameplay footage tutorial. It's awesome. All right, here we are at the main menu of Watch Dogs. So let's do this. So you look in the camera, guys. Here's my PS3 six-axis DualShock 3 game controller. We can see this is the real thing, the Sony DS3. So let's do this. So let's go to continue. Press X there to continue the game. I'll show you proof that uh, I'll go ahead and hijack a car real quick here. Show you proof that, yeah, my guy's walking around fine. Um, he can run fine. He can access the map fine. He can uh, monitor, or actually I will be able to monitor and maneuver the camera when I'm driving. You know, everything like you would expect the Xbox 360 game controller to do. Well, guess what? I got the PS3 game controller to emulate that as well. Now, I suppose if you have the proper drivers for the PS4 controller or the Xbox One controller, yeah, it should work. I don't see any issues with that. But I don't have those game controllers, so I can't show that off. But like I said, this is awesome because this is a, um, what do you call it, 64-bit um, game. And we got this to work with the 64-bit drivers. So here I am driving in the car. Here I am driving. Oops. Let me make sure my controller is in the camera there. Press R2. I'm driving. I'm driving. I'm driving. Uh, if I want to press select, guys, here's the select. Here's the map here. Let's go ahead and select my waypoint. 
exit that, and there we go. We're good to go. Um, if I want to uh, navigate the traffic lights, let's go ahead and press square. You see that? I just mess around with that traffic light. Awesome. And then here's the camera with the right analog stick. You see that, guys, in the camera? See that? My car is going around and around and around. So, yeah. So, anyways, this clearly works. We're using the Motion Enjoy tool. We're using the Sony PS3 game controller. I don't really know if it's going to work okay with your clone controller, so just give it a try. And if it doesn't work, well, time to get a different controller. So, that is today's video game tutorial. If you guys have any nitpicky questions, leave a comment here on the YouTube page and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Once again, thank you for watching. Take care. Bye.